I've never been the best at something. I've never had the first place nor second place. Best I've achieved was a third place in a game jam at school. But there's one thing I'm really good at, playing my own game. But how can everyone know that I am the best player in the world? In fact, I think I've got the perfect solution. Let's create a real-time Discord leaderboard for my game. In my last video, I showcased the Fodian game I'm working on. It's a blast, especially for speedrunning enthusiasts. Today, we will integrate Discord with my game to make a leaderboard for my Discord server. Huh? Imagine seeing your name at the top. And that's not all. I've cooked up some brand new features that are top secret. Oh, I'm terrible at keeping surprises. It's a big game update, so stick around till the end. Please, please, please. To kickstart our project, the first step is creating an application on the Discord developer portal. I needed a name for my Discord bot, so I chose Choose the Bot. Why? Cause why not? I even crafted an avatar for Juice the Bot, making it my digital twin. I had no clue about how to make pixel art in GIMP, and apparently, nowadays you need to use a sprite if you want to be cool. <laughs> Hours later, the masterpiece was born. It's me, but pixelated. I think they look similar enough, except that I forgot to draw a dog. My bad. What the dog doing? After setting the bot permissions, I finally had a new friend in my Discord server. It'd be cool if you joined too. Link in description. Et voila, the end. Psych, I need to code the bot first. Here's how the leaderboard will be implemented. First, I grab the speedrun time as soon as the run ends. Next, with a little magic from the Discord SDK, I snag the player's Discord ID. Then, I forward the time to Firebase, the database service I use. Ultimately, my Discord bot always listens to database updates, keeping the leaderboard fresh. After several lines of code and an avalanche of tests, seriously, a lot of tests, it was finally the moment of truth. All that was left to do was to start the Discord bot program. I had succeeded. I was so happy that I even called my mother to tell her the good news. Mom. What? Huh? But then, other names began creeping onto the leaderboard. No one was beating my record until. Two people had beaten me. I was, once again, third place. Turns out, 70 people have downloaded the game and some of you are just better than me at my own game. I am better! However, do you know who's better than these people? Look at this! 94% of viewers aren't subscribed. Help me change that. Hit subscribe, leave a like, and drop a comment. Thank you! So yeah, I might not be the best at my own game, but... Wait a minute. Let me just create a new level section including new gameplay objects such as wind zones, sticky blocks, and moving platforms. Oh, and the cherry on top, I added a podium showing the best of the best players. So shout out to myself, Clementine, and Ice for living. Anyways, it's really regrettable, but since the level has changed, it makes the leaderboard obsolete. Unfortunately, I have to wipe the current speedrun timings. After a few tries at speedrunning, I hit a pretty decent score. I dare you to try beating me, but... You're not that guy, pal. Trust me. You're not that guy. The game is free to download on itch.io. The link is in the description. Think you can break into the top 10? Join my Discord and see where you stand in the leaderboard channel. Before I let you go, I need to know if you'd prefer me to work on a bus fight or to start working on visuals. Let me know in the comments what you think. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.